The overall goal of this protocol is to provide multidimensional assessment of how compounds affect M. tuberculosis survival inside human macrophages. This method is centered on a luciferase-based efficacy assay. When combined with cytotoxicity, an MIC assay can provide useful information into mode of action of heat compounds in TB drug development. The main advantage of our method is that it is time and labor saving. It is replacing a CFU colony forming unit assay with a luciferase based assay. Generally, individuals new to this technique would struggle with consistency with manual pipetting instead of automation. A consistent pipetting technique is crucial. Grow THP1 cells in RPMI in complete medium. While maintaining a cell density of 0.2 to 1 million cells per milliliter of medium between passages. Use a spectrophotometer to measure the OD600 of an actively growing bacterial suspension. Then calculate the bacterial density using the conversion factor of 0.1 OD600 equals 3 times 10 to the 7th bacteria per milliliter. Pipette out sufficient bacteria for an MOI of 10 to 1 into a new centrifuge tube. Then pellet the bacteria at 3,000 times G for 10 minutes. To opsonize the bacteria, add 50 microliters of human serum to 450 microliters of RPMI 1640 and use it to resuspend the bacterial pellet at a density of 1 times 10 to the 8th bacteria per 500 microliters of medium. Allow the mixture to incubate.